Hello team. How are you guys? Happy Sunday. I was just taking a break from the kiddos because they've been kind of on one today. And as I was driving, I was like, you know what? I never really talk about the importance of planning. Like I do it every week, um, but I never really talk about it. So Sundays is my day to kind of just relax and take it easy. I spend time with family. We go to church, do all that kind of stuff. And then at night before I go to bed, I plan my entire week. So I have my planner and I open it up. And the first thing I do is I put all the family stuff. So I put in the days that I work, I put in any appointments that we have, any extracurricular activities like my daughter's dance class or maybe like a play day that we got invited to. And then I go in and I put in all my sensey stuff that I have to do. And I break it down like literally to everything, like have host conversations, have joint conversations. I put in there um, how much PRV I want to sell for the week. The reason why I say that this is so important is because if you do not set a plan to how you're going to work your business, you're setting up yourself for failure. Because if you don't have a plan, it's not going to be a priority. So guess what? You're going to leave it up in the air. And if you don't get to it, you don't get to it. But if you set it as a priority, if you have it on your planner, it's on your to-do list, you're going to get it done whether it's on the day that you set it or maybe a day later or maybe a day before, who knows, but you're gonna get it done. So um, I prefer planners that have like the whole calendar and then break it down week by week, but you can get anything as cheap as like a Dollar Tree planner that has just like the calendar or, you know, go get a fancy planner. But trust me, if you don't use it, it doesn't matter how much you paid for it. It's not gonna do the work for you. Um, one of my favorite planners is the Happy Planner. I got it from Michaels. Um, it was super inexpensive, super, super easy to use. Um, and I just, I write in it every single day. Like I honestly put everything that I want to accomplish in there. And that way I don't forget. That way I just have to just open up my planner and be like, what did I have to do today for my business? Um, like I said, if you don't set up a plan, then you're setting up yourself for failure because then things are going to get forgotten that you're not going to do and you're not going to achieve those goals. So break down those goals, put them in a planner, check your planner every single day and determine how you're working your business. Um, I challenge you to do that this week and see how much better you are working your business. Another thing that that planner helps me do is that for example, if I'm going to go to a doctor's appointment, I know that I'm going to be running into people. So I'm going to be prepared because I'm going to have samples in my bag. I'm going to have um, product sheets, my business cards, anything like that. And if someone asks me or if I get the courage up and I offer them something, I already have it there. And I knew I was going to go there. I knew I was going to see people. So it kind of helps me to determine who will I see this week by just putting it out there on my planner. But if I just keep winging it, then I might run into someone at a doctor's appointment or my daughter's dance class or something, and they might ask me for something. I'd be like, oh, I don't have any business cards or I don't have any product sheets. Oops, I just missed out on an opportunity. So like I said, I challenge you guys to write down the places you're gonna go, think of who you're gonna come across, and then plan out your week and see how much better you work your business this week, okay? Till next time, bye.